Hello my cookies. Today we are going to be making some thick and creamy broccoli and cheese soup. Let's cook. Okay, let's start by melting some butter. And when that melts, we're gonna add in our diced onions. And I always forget to film my minced garlic. I threw some of that in there as well. And we're gonna stir it around for about a minute or so. Then we're gonna add in some grated carrots. I just used a cheese grater. And we're gonna stir that around with the butter, onions, and garlic. Here I'm adding some all-purpose flour to make my roux. This is gonna make our soup really, really thick. So stir out that flour for about a minute to get rid of the floury taste. And when that's done, go ahead and pour in that chicken broth. Bring that up to a simmer and as soon as it heats up, you'll be able to see how thick it gets like almost instantly. So now we're gonna add in our broccoli florets. I used frozen broccoli. I just thawed them in the microwave using the defrost setting, took them out, chopped them up, and now we're adding them in. Give it all a stir, lower the heat, and then we're gonna cover the pot and allow it to simmer on low for 15 minutes. Next, we're gonna pour in the half and half. This is gonna make our soup super creamy. And we're just gonna stir that up. And while it's coming to a simmer, we're gonna add in our onion and garlic powders. You can also add in your salt and pepper to taste here. Time for some cheese. Now I don't wanna hear it. I'm using American cheese and I know somebody's gonna leave in the comments. That's not real cheese. Listen, I am grown and nothing melts quite like this American cheese. So I'm gonna use it, okay? And I'm also gonna add in some sharp cheddar as well. All right, just stir it all up. And when the cheese melts, turn off the heat. Now it's time to add in some nutmeg and Lord, y'all look what I did way too much nutmeg but that's okay it was a little Christmassy, but it was all right stir it all up and baby it is time to eat cookies that is it for my broccoli and cheese soup the recipe link will be down there in the description box thank you so very much for watching be sure to give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this look how thick and creamy that is come on now i gotta eat so until next time be blessed